after Western blot transfer is completed, the membrane undergoes a series of incubation and wash steps to prepare the membrane and probe it for your target protein. The first step, called blocking, coats the membrane surface with a protein or other molecule that is non-reactive to the antibody that will be used to probe for your target protein, or antigen. Nitrocellulose and PVDF membranes have a high protein binding affinity, which is essential for successful western blot analysis. The blocking step ensures that the antibody binds specifically to the antigen rather than non-specifically to the membrane surface, which can result in high background signal that prevents detection of your protein of interest. The membrane is blocked with a buffer that is often comprised of tris or phosphate buffered saline with tween 20 detergent and up to 5% of a non-reactive protein such as bovine serum albumin, non-fat milk, gelatin, or normal serum. The exact formulation and incubation period depends on the antibody, membrane type, and substrate system used. And identifying the formulation that yields the highest signal-to-noise ratio requires empirical testing. To block your membrane, immerse it in a blocking buffer for one to two hours at room temperature or overnight in the cold room. After blocking is completed, wash the membrane three times with a wash buffer such as TBST or PBST alone and the blocked membrane will then be ready to be probed for your proteins of interest.